Welcome to another episode of Solitaire Rant Quest. Yeah, Solitaire Rant Quest. I'm the Blood Knight of the Old Republic of Blood Ghanistan. And this is me and my thoughts on sex dolls. Now, we live in a society. We live in a society where pussy is now, with, with, with good pussy is hard to come by. We live in a, where good pussy is hard to come by, and some good women are, are hard to come by. They're, they're rare. They're few and far between. I'm not saying they don't exist, but they exist in scarcity these days. These are my thoughts on what a sex doll means for society. Now, people think that a holodeck, as soon as we invent holodeck technology, the moment we invent holodeck technology is when uh, society is when society collapses. No, 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 no. No, 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 that's not when society, that is not when society collapses. The moment when good pussy, the moment when good pussy dries up is when, the moment when good pussy and, and, uh, the, the moment when good pussy dries up is when, when society falls. And yeah, we live in a world where very realistic sex dolls exist. What does a sex doll mean for a man, for a man who buys a sex doll? Well, it means pussy whenever he wants, no back talk. Unless it's unless back talk is built in, even then there's probably probably an off switch for that. No back talk. No back talk. No significant drainage of financial resources except for the cost cost of initial purchase, and and for and for maintenance, and you also have. You also have. It also, it's also more high. It's also more hygienic. It's also more hygienic because you can clean, clean the clean that sex doll with bleach. You, you can clean it with. We could clean. You could clean it with bleach. Now, yeah. If you're a man. And, yeah, you can't get laid. You buy yourself a sex doll. You at some point want to be a father, but you can't get any real pussy. Well, moment, moment artificial wombs get invented. You could have men out there just going to the artificial womb clinic, making a, making, just jerking himself off. Put it into a cup, and then yeah, put make make himself a kid at the artificial womb clinic. He can make himself a kid, and he could probably choose which gender he wants. He could probably choose which gender he wants, and and you ask most men out there, what gender? What gender a kid of kid do you want? Would you prefer? They're all gonna say boys. They're gonna say they're gonna say they're gonna say male. So you could potentially have a future where where women literally get out. They literally get. The, the women get phased out. 
that could literally happen. You could literally have a you could literally have women one day just get phased out, which is crazy. It is possible. The technology, the artificial womb technology is coming. Yeah. Like you could have, you could literally have collectives of men just, uh, just make, just raising kids. You'd have men, straight men, getting together. And it's like, hey, I want a son. You want a son. Let's go 50-50. Go to the artificial womb clinic. Get ourselves a son. And we don't have to bang each other. Because we got our sex dolls. And yeah, you could have that happen. Which is crazy. <sighs> yeah. It is crazy. Now, now, some of the argument, you, 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 some of the arguments you're, you're thinking about, it's like, well, you need women around. Who's gonna do? Who's gonna? Who's gonna do? Who's gonna? Who's who's gonna? Who, who's gonna cook and clean? Oh, but with modern fez, feminism. Modern feminism, modern modern day feminism, all of those uh, women roles have now been, uh, they're now being phased out of women, so it's like, yeah. Yeah. Like one of the, one of the justifications for having women around, well, they're good at cooking and cleaning, uh, but not anymore. No, feminism has taken taken that out of the the skill set, the repertoire. But yeah, it is it is crazy. You could you could by the end maybe not this century, but several centuries down the line, you could have an all male society. It is possible. If artificial womb technology gets developed, you could have that. So, yeah. And, yeah. What would a, what would a society run by all guys look like? Damn, it'd be crazy. That'd be some crazy shit. But yeah. It it is it is crazy. It's crazy to think about. It's crazy to think about. These are my thoughts on the topic. These are my thoughts. I'm just putting them out there. So yeah, I'm the Blood Knight of the Old Republic of Blood Ganistan. Like, share, and subscribe. Stay frosty. Stay sexy, San Diego. I'm a spaceman. Get your jewels in one way you can. Peace out.